More commonly though, you are going to be using it as some kind of lighting method, such as we're doing here with this old factory backdrop. To use it as such and for lighting, there's a couple of ways that we can do it. First of all, we can use GI. We will of course come to GI later. And all you see is that we have this option here for sample backdrop on and off. This will be more clear if I disable the main light there and you can see that as I turn the backdrop on and off then the diffuse part of our sphere here is no longer lit. It's no longer getting colour because it's not getting light from the backdrop. There's also another way that we can use it for lighting. So let's turn the GI off. We'll turn our light back on and we'll come into the light properties and we'll set it to be an environment light. Again, you see here that we have this option sample backdrop. When that is checked, it uses the backdrop as the illumination cast by the light.